Here's a titration calculation and it involves a dichromate with iodide um, and there's actually two equations involved. Uh, one is there's the dichromate reacting with iodide ions, oxidizing those iodide ions and turning them into iodine. Uh, there's actually a subsequent reaction which is that iodine solution which is formed is then titrated with sodium thiosulfate. So uh, let's break it down into steps. The first part of the question says a standard solution is prepared by dissolving 1.185 grams of potassium dichromate and making up to 250 cm cubed of solution. So here is weighed out that mass of dichromate put into a volumetric flask 250 cm cubed and we can work out the number of moles, the amount of dichromate by taking the mass and dividing by the relative molecular mass and there is the amount of dichromate which is in the 250 cm cubed volumetric flask. Then says a 25 cm cubed portion of the dichromate was acidified and added to an excess of potassium iodide to liberate iodine. So here is the volumetric flask which has got this many moles of the dichromate and we're taking out a 25 cm cubed portion, there's a tenth of it. So taking out a tenth uh, reduces the amount to 3.99 times 10 to the minus 4 moles of dichromate that we're going to have in here. That is reacted with an excess of Ki, that's got the iodide ions here. What's important about this equation is that there's a 1 to 3 ratio between the dichromate and the iodine formed. So we can work out the amount of iodine formed is 3 times the amount of dichromate that there was, 1.20 times 10 to the minus 3. The final part of the question says, when the iodine solution was titrated against sodium thiosulfate, 17.5 cm cubed of thiosulfate were required find the concentration of the thiosulfate solution. So here's the uh, titration apparatus. We know the amount of iodine. We don't know the concentration of thiosulfate. So what we're going to do is work out the amount, the number of moles of thiosulfate, then using the volume we can work out the concentration. To work out the amount of thiosulfate we need to know the equation which is 2 S2O3 2 minus reacting with one of the I2s. It's so a 2 to 1 ratio. We know the amount of iodine, so we multiply it by 2 to get the amount of thiosulfate. The information that we now know is 2.39 times 10 to the minus 3 moles of thiosulfate are in 17.5 cm cubed. So to work out the concentration, take the moles, divide by the volume. There's the moles, there's the volume being converted into dm cubed, and here. 0.137 moles per dm cubed is the concentration of the thiosulfate solution.